Since 1890, Cold Spring Harbor Laboratory has been at the forefront of the scientific community and discovery. It is a small research institution where scientists ask deep questions. We're very proud of our history here at the lab and all the fundamental discoveries that have been made, sort of drawing inspiration from the past to find the next frontier. This is really a place, it's the nexus of where everything happens. The scientists that work here and then people that come through here for the meetings and courses, we're exposed to a lot of new ideas from scientists all over the world, and this influences our own science and our own questions. For me, what makes Cold Spring Harbor unique is the absolute freedom to do the research that I want to do. Not only does a leadership appreciate this kind of creative freedom. You take high risk, if you fail, it's okay. It's better that you have, you've tried. Right? A lot of people say that, but I actually visibly see in their actions and words. The lab has had a long tradition of empowering young scientists to become independent researchers and leading their own labs at a very early age. There's so many great scientists here and we wanted to do just as well as everybody else. So we push ourselves to be the best that we can be every day. And that the outcome of that is great science. Cold Spring Harbor is the ultimate hub in order to make these, these discoveries to learn basically what's happening in biology throughout the world. But because the high impact nature of the biology that's being done here by many of the researchers really illustrates how Cold Spring Harbor is at the leading edge of what's happening in biology. One of the advantages of being a Cold Spring Harbor laboratory is the very collaborative environment. There are scientists in, you know, doing, studying the brain, studying cancer, studying plant biology. I'm having conversations with neurobiologists here at Cold Spring Harbor, cancer biologists. That brings an interdisciplinary component to what we do that is very rich. I don't think at any other institution you can you sort of be so immersed in your profession as this one. Just the geography of just being here, raising a family here, both accentuates my family experience, but also the experience of running a lab, because it's not just a job. The lab really feels like, really feels like a community, both to, to work and live. It's home. The lab is my home. It's the place that I've always dreamed to be as a scientist. The real benefit of Cold Spring Harbor in terms of facilitating work-life balance is that there is nobody breathing down my neck. The person breathing down my neck is me. The lab makes sure that they just give you that freedom, and that freedom is something that I think is extremely precious in science. There isn't another environment like this in the world where you can have this kind of high-powered research in this beautiful environment where you have international visitors coming through all the time, and you can't get an experience like that anywhere else. There's absolutely no institution that operates like this place, both at the leadership level, the character of the scientists. There's nothing like it, and nothing comes even close.